XTV is the proud home of the first ever, the historic Belize Diaspora Summit 2024. It's going to be taking place June 19th to June 22nd at the Marriott Hotel LAX in Los Angeles, California. And we will bring you two days full coverage. But before we get there, can we just get an understanding of exactly what is the Belize Diaspora Summit? Like, if, what is a diaspora period? And why are we having a summit? Why do they need a summit? These are questions that need to be answered. Now, the diaspora just means Belizeans living abroad, all over, wherever on planet Earth, you can find Belizeans and they're proud to be. And of course, as you would imagine, most of them live in the United States of America. So the very first diaspora summit is going to be in Los Angeles, California. Big deal, yes. But we've got to find out the details. We want to know why, what's up with this? And so for that, we start asking questions. We first got a chance to sit down with one of the organizers, Wishma Eckert. And she says, guess what? People are excited and she's impressed so far with the level of interest being shown by lesions in the diaspora. The response is overwhelming excitement. The response is just, there was a need for it. They can't wait to attend. The response is just really the anticipation and people are starting to ask where next? What next city? Are you going to be doing this every year? So there's definitely an excitement in the air. Why do you feel there's a need to have a summit for Belizeans and those of uh, for Belizean descent? Right. Uh, why do you think there has to be a? Why do you think there needs to be a summit? Right. Good question. Because this the theme that we chose for this year is power and unity, and the reason we chose that is because there are pockets of Belizeans everywhere in the U.S. and abroad, but there isn't a place. Or, or an event that we can get together and share ideas, um, plan for the future of the diaspora, talk about the history. Um, there isn't a hub, so to speak. So this is where the summit comes in, and this is why it's so important to partake, because this is a way for us to meet and a hub for us to be able to share our thoughts and also get services provided to the diaspora. Now, whenever you're having a summit, one of the first questions people want to know is, well, uh, how can you make it have some lasting impact? How can you really make it relevant? How can you make it be something that you can have from year to year? Or how do you prevent it from being just a matter of talking heads and just a lot of talking? I think the power and unity theme is really what makes it different. Because in knowing what our focus is going to be, in, in galvanizing the diaspora for, like I said, for uh, example, the voting rights or whatever the case may be, we're able, even though we have a small team, we're going to be able to take some metrics out of it, being able to follow up, being able to see whether or not it was, it's a success so that we can take it to another city. So this is different in the sense that there is a plan for continuous follow up and there's also a plan to not just follow up individually about the initiatives, but also the business connections that are being made. So we are able to, for example, go to the business showcase and say, hey, how many people did you get interested in, in your product? How much sales did you make? We're able to go to the panel discussions and follow up with the individual panelists and say if there was any activity done. And then because we're selling tickets to the gala, for example, we can see the numbers. It's going to be something very tangible that we can get out of this so that we could then use that for the power in unity to be able to take it to another city and another city and just eventually being able to have this one hub of a summit where everyone knows that when the summit happens this is where all the legions go and here's where we go to do business with each other connect with each other and empower each other now, Rishma is actually a member of the Belize American Chamber of Commerce and they have been hosting an event annually called the Investment Forum and that has been a meeting place for investors and for people in finance, both at home and abroad, who want to talk about opportunities and want to talk about getting together to do good business. And they have been holding this event. This event is actually going to be a part of the summit and that is going to be very interesting. The Belize American Chamber of Commerce is having their Belizean, Belize Investment Forum on the Friday of the summit, and that is going to be completely business-focused, investment-focused, and it's a way to bring investors and potential businesses together so that you can talk shop, you can go ahead and network on your own, and it's, again, just providing the space and providing the arena and the venue for you to be in the same room together. 
Now, this is just the tip of the iceberg. We are just getting started with this matter because we've got a lot more questions to ask about Belize Diaspora Summit 2024. And you deserve the answers to those questions. We've got more folks to interview. We have more of these preview shows to bring you. So make sure you tune into XTV. I'm Mosad reporting. And remember, we will be bringing you live coverage for two days full of the Belize Diaspora Summit 2024. Now, you better, better make sure... You don't miss any of it.